Hello everybody, this is Pradeep Shadigar and I'm here to update you about my new uh, sponge filter which I have announced, I have made a DIY uh, sponge filter with enhanced capacity for the wire filtration and this is my 30 gallon tall tank, uh, this is uh, fairly lowly stocked with just 5 bank wind tetras and 2 molies and uh, there are some uh, you know chinese bamboo shoots which uh, you can see here but i would not recommend you to do that because uh, it's preferable to have a chinese bamboo uh, plant uh, with that leaves above the uh, water level but here i have put it under it and uh, uh, i'm running a risk of having these bamboo shoots actually uh, rotting it but uh, i'll make sure that i'll remove it before it does so but uh, the primary focus here is the sponge filter which i have uh, uh, made uh, with enhanced biofiltration here which i have an inverted uh, juice bottle which i have attached on the uh, lift tube of this particular sponge filter with a rubber band here i have inserted uh, tried to insert a rubber band here between the uh, tube and the uh, lip of the plastic bottle here I'll show you this uh, here. This is what I have done. I have uh, uh, run an air tube from the lift tube and the bottle here at the top, and I have uh, made some uh, uh, fine holes. I've drilled some holes on the on the uh, pop bottle here, which uh, allows the air air to come out. And I have uh, put in a lot of uh, bendy straws here, approximately 20-25 bendy straws here inside this particular bottle, which would, uh, which announces the uh, biofiltration capacity of this particular uh, filter. The primary objective of this particular filter is to make sure that there's a lot of biofiltration available here, and a uh, you know, lot of uh, good bacteria here, which would enhance my particular filtration. This is how does it work. I hope you like this video and uh, it would be great if you can write in some comments on this particular video if you like that. Thanks. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you.